This exercise video is presented by Active Health Services for LifeMark Seniors Wellness. Please note that you should always consult with your physician prior to following this video or any exercise program. This video does not replace, nor should you interpret it as medical advice. Do not proceed with any exercises that are beyond your fitness or ability level. And for safety reasons, we highly recommend that you have someone in your presence while you participate in our online videos. If you experience any pain or discomfort at any point during these exercises, please stop and never ignore or delay seeking medical attention if pain or discomfort persists. As with any exercise program, there are risks in participating. Participation in LifeMark Seniors Wellness class is done so at one's own risk, understanding that no medical assessment or supervision is provided to determine suitability for the program. LifeMark Seniors Wellness is not responsible or liable for any harm, loss, medical problems, or other consequences you may suffer or cause in resulting from the use of this video or the reliance on the information provided to you in this video. And by choosing to proceed with this video, you acknowledge that you understand the terms on which we are providing the video and you agree to those terms. And if for any reason you're not comfortable with these terms or you do not fully understand them, we kindly ask that you do not proceed with the exercise. Um, I'm just gonna get you to roll on the bottom of your feet here. Just so it's basically just a heel lift, okay? Try and stay with that beat if you can hear it. It's gonna start nice and easy. All right, I'm gonna get you just to turn your head to your right. Lift your heart, back is flat, excellent. And bring your head back to center. Don't rush any of this stuff, not the beginning, okay? Bring your head to the other side, your heart lifted, excellent. Breathing from your belly, bring your head back to center. Breathing from your belly or diaphragm, in through your nose, out through your mouth, all right? With your heart lifted, your back flat, you're gonna lower your chin to your chest. Fantastic. Bring your head back up. Excellent. One more. Big stretch, lift your head up. It's a gentle stretch on your neck. Keep your heart lifted and back flat. Excellent. Perfect. And bring your arms, your head back to center. Your arms are already there, it's okay. Gentle shoulder shrugs. Keep that beat, if you can. Let me get the beat, and we're good to go. One shoulder at a time, up, and then down. You can hang your hands if you like, totally up to you. Other side, and down. Let it set, then the other side. You like you can even add deep breath in as you raise your shoulder exhale as it comes down perfect one more time on each side excellent perfect we're just gonna do, do some shoulder rolls, only because it's a good thing to do. Start small. And again, just keep your heart lifted in your back flat. And breathe, breathing's good. Excellent. And as your shoulders start to warm up a little bit, you can make that range of motion just a little bigger. Excellent. We're just concerned with getting uh, synovial fluid or the, the lubrication that's in your joint, getting it going. That's kind of what we're working for here. Excellent. And change direction. Fantastic. One more time. Perfect. Just gonna shake that out. You got your beat. Let's go with uh, an arm raise, okay? So your arms, bring them up. Fingers extended, I'm just gonna wiggle your fingers. Excellent, watch what's around you. You don't wanna knock anything over. Change, you're gonna rotate your hands at the wrist. And you bring your arms forward. Fantastic. 
stay here, change direction. I'm gonna stay here. That's it. Keep your heart lifted, and your back flat. Perfect. And reach, wiggle your fingers again. Nice. Flip your hands up, fingertips together, and bring them to your shoulder. All right, hand out. And back in, take your time. There's no number to meet here. It's all good. Nice deep breaths in through your nose and out through your mouth. Fantastic, one more. Back to your shoulder, keep your fingertips there and just separate your elbows. Excellent. Then elbows together, apart. Excellent, big stretch. Just enjoy the movement of your shoulders, your arms, your shoulder blades. Excellent. One more time here. Fantastic. Bring your arms down. All right. Today, for the first time, I'm warming up. That's good. Let's go with uh, hands on your knees. You can stay with the bead or not for this particular one. It's up to you. Then do some trunk circles. Okay. Your arms do the work. Hands. Actually, stop your feet. And you do some circles here. Okay. Let your arms do the work. Perfect. That circle can be big or small as you like. Your call. Excellent. And back to the center again. I'm going to stop here. I'm going to change direction. And the same thing again. Nice and easy here. Make sure you're breathing. As you come forward, you can inhale. And as you go back, exhale. That would be fairly good to do. Work with your body. One more circle and bring yourself back to center. Perfect. Fantastic. And we're going to go back to our heel lift here. Excellent. Lift your back. And back or lift your heart and your back is flat. All right. Let's go with um, arms again. So big breast strokes here. Big reach. And again, just work at your own pace. You know what that is. In your own range of motion. Excellent. One more here. Fantastic. Bring your arms down. Shake that out. I'm going to get you to focus on one of your feet. One leg. Opposite arm. You can do a bicep curl. Start low. Bring it up. And flex muscle. Fist. And back down. Pull up, flex, and release. Up, flex, and release. Keep your heart lifted and your back flat. Excellent. I'm gonna do a couple more here. Flex. Excellent. Last one. Flex. Shake that out, switch sides. So now the other foot's doing the heel tap. The first one stopped, opposite arm, and down and up, same thing. Bicep curl, flex, and down. Flex, make sure your back is flat, your heart is lifted. Deep breaths in through your nose and out through your mouth. Excellent. Perfect. One more. Up and flex. Fantastic. And down. Perfect. Shake those out. Bring myself back to center here. 
I'm gonna get you to switch your feet. Now, we were doing uh, heel lifts. We're gonna change to toe lifts, both at the same time. You won't get many, it's okay. These muscles aren't made for doing long sitting taps like this anyways. Lift your heart. And soon you'll feel those muscles in the front. You'll feel like you're lifting through molasses and it'll start getting thicker like dough. And eventually you won't be able to move them anymore. And that's okay. Change back to heels. All right, excellent. Lift your heart. Nice deep breath. Perfect. Okay, so watch the arms of your chair if you're in an armed chair. We're gonna get some arm movement here. You're gonna pick your feet up. Excellent. Get your arms pumping a little bit. Uh, your fist, you can tighten them up for the first little bit here. It's gonna raise your blood pressure and make it make it beat and make your heart beat faster too. So if that's a problem. You may want to keep a nice soft guest while you're doing this. Excellent. Perfect. Okay, so with this beat here, I'm just kind of following the song. If you like, stay here. Or if you'd like, you can double the speed. A little bit harder, but something to try. All right, I'm gonna double it. Excellent. And back to just that regular beat. Excellent. Perfect. Breathe. Soft fists. Excellent. We're just going to change the position of our hip flexors just because. Heels forward. Okay. So heel. Excellent. Get your arms. And again, you can make your arms work as best you can, or whatever works for you. Nice deep breaths. I'm trying to get you warmed up, right? That's what you're shooting for too. A bit of a mild glow. Excellent. We can come back to our march again. Fantastic. Heart's lifted. The back is flat. Perfect. Fantastic. Come back to your rolling march again. Feet are planted on the ground. Just lifting your heels. Opposite. Okay. I'm going to get you to have a sip of water. I'm going to change over a little bit here. Try and keep your feet moving while you get your sip of water. Excellent. Perfect. Uh, I'm gonna get you to stand up. I'd like you to stand up. And back to our rolling march. Shake your arms out. One second here. So back to our rolling march again. Feet are planted. Lift your heart. Arms going. Chair for balance if you need it. Just keep it handy. It's all good. Fantastic. We're going to do a little bit of uh, knee work here. So we're going to do some knee ups. Bring your arms out front. Okay. Wherever you want your knees to come to. Heart lifted. Nice even breaths. In through your nose, out through your mouth. Nice and deep too. Your muscles will appreciate that. That's how they get energy. Oxygen exchange. Perfect. 
you like, either stay here or you can add the uh, bit of a twist. Knees stay doing the front upright position and it's just your upper torso that twists. Fantastic. Nice work. Bring your hands back to the front again. Perfect. And back to our march. Fantastic. Let's uh, do a little forward backward thing. Okay. So, one foot forward, one in the back. They're not quite together. You're just a little bit about hip width apart. Okay. Arms. Counterbalance. If you like, you can lift the feet up. Let's just change this a little bit. So like you're lifting that foot up, the string. And again, you're working at your own pace. Whatever works for you, it's all good. Excellent. Keep smiling. Excellent. Bring your feet down. Heel toe. Excellent. We're going to switch leading legs. Bring the other leg out front. Excellent. Your heart lifted. Back flat. Hinge from your hips. Okay. You got a string attached to that front foot. Pull up. Again, you work to your own level of what you can do, what your body will do for you. Excellent. Lift up. Excellent. And bring your feet back down. Again, heel toe. Perfect. And back to our march. So if you're thirsty at any time, take a sip. It's all good. Heart lifted, your back flat. You're going to stay with a march. This time, bring your hands out, just out from your body a little bit. And you're just going to roll them in front of you. This is a really popular disco move back in the 80s. <laughs> Not that we're going to jump into disco rate yet, but work on the moves, right? All right, change direction. Excellent, fantastic. Keep going, keep going. Excellent, and bring those down to a slow, perfect. Shake your arms out if you need to. We're gonna bring feet across the front. So it's gonna be a crossover. Excellent. Just bend your arms. Want to make sure that you're working those biceps, elbows. Excellent. And if you so desire, you can cross over in the back. Perfect. And bring your crossover back to the front again. Nice work. Perfect. And back to our march. If you haven't had a sip since the last time I said, have a sip of water. Keep it handy. Try and keep your feet moving. Excellent. Let's go for a little wider stance. Okay, tap and tap. Bring your arms up. Lift your heart, back is flat. Hands don't go higher than your shoulders. Keep them 
below that. Excellent. So if you so desire, you can also bring up both arms at the same time. Again, totally up to you, however you feel. You're flying. Excellent. Breathe, deep breath. Fantastic. And bring your arms down. And I'm just going to do a little bit of a sway here. Watch your water bottle. No higher than your shoulders. Excellent. Big circles. Big figure eight in front of you. Feel a little twist in your back. Be gentle. Be mindful of what's going on. Breathe. Perfect. Whoops. Excellent. And back to center. And our march. Fantastic. Uh, we'll do some punches. We haven't done those for a little while, so I think we'll stay with that. Um, we'll try something a little different today. Try and stay with your march, and we'll punch at the same time, okay? If that's too much, do the punching part, okay? I'll count you in. I'm gonna start with your right hand, okay? Count you in. Four, three, two, one. Punch, punch, hook, and up. Punch, punch, hook. So find a little spot in front of you, hook. And that's where your fists meet all the time. Hook, and up. Punch, hook, and up. Punch. Excellent. Fantastic. How's that marching going? <laughs> A little different, huh? It's good. Good to mix it up. Punch. Punch. Hook. Up. Two more. Hook. And up. Last one. Punch. Hook. And up. And back to a march. Fantastic. We're going to switch to the other side, because we can, right? Let's start with our left hand punching first, all right? And if you're marching, try and keep the marching going. It's good too. I'll count you in. Four, three, two, and one. Punch, punch, hook, and up. Punch, punch, hook, up. Punch, punch, Hook and up. Punch, punch, hook and up. Punch, hook, fantastic. Two more. Punch, hook, and up. And last punch. Punch, hook, and up. Excellent. Back to our march again. Boy, when that music changes midstream. Have a sip of water. It keeps everything lubricated too, you know, the water. Your, well, your fascia, the muscle connecting tissue, good for that. And since you're like 75% water, it's good to keep that level kind of up there too. Really important. Alrighty, let's go for uh, heel forward. We're not gonna do too much too crazy here. Both hands together. So what we're gonna do, keep our heels the same, okay? So push twice, push, and then up twice. So push, push, and then up, up. Push, push, up, up. Push, push. So like you're pushing a little kid along and then up and over that hill. Push, push. Fantastic. Push, push, up. Two more. Push, push, up, up. Push, excellent. Back to our march. Nice work. Fantastic. I'm just going to slow things down a little bit. 
cool down. So I'm gonna get you to change your march to the rolling march. Feet are on the mat or the floor rather. All right, arms. I'm gonna start low, rotate those hands. I'm gonna bring them up in front. Fantastic. Change direction. Bring your arms out to the side. Fantastic. Stop right there. Fingertips up. Tilt. Just your arms. Try and keep your torso upright. Just your arms come up. Fingertips are up. Excellent. Back down to center. Fantastic. And the other side. Breathe. Excellent. And back to center again. Excellent. Straighten your fingers out. Just wiggle them. I'm going to get you to make a fist. And you're going to throw that ball that's in your hands. So fist and spread. Fist, spread. Fist, spread. Fist. Excellent. Like you're trying to shoot water off the ends of your fingers. Excellent. Two more, one more, excellent. Just lower your arms down. That uh, flicking motion is really good for arthritis. Prevents it and helps it feel better. I mean, it's gonna go, right? Shoulders, nice and easy. You can do shoulder rolls. You're gonna stay with the small circles here. You're not gonna go to the big ones, okay? Breathe. Fantastic. Your heart lifted and your back flat. Still rolling. Change direction. Again, don't go to big circles. Stay with the small ones. Kind of a little harder, but you know you can do it. Excellent. And stop right there. That's perfect. Shake your shoulders out. Shake your arms out. Fantastic. It's going to get you to come back into a march. Easy march. Okay. Toe tap straight down. Keep your heart lifted. Your back flat. Excellent. Do a little hip twist in. Excellent. And you can be as hippie as you like. You can go crazy hippie. Or not so much. And hip twist out. Excellent. Fantastic. And back to your rolling march. Feet are planted. Perfect. Arms back up again. Flex your arms nice and strong and down and up. Perfect. Fantastic. Lower your arms. We're going to change now. I'm going to do the. Uh, let's go for. Um, let's go for balance first. I'm going to get you to stay standing. Turn this down just a little bit. Excellent. Stay standing. Have a sip of water. We're going to go right into balance. I know it's crazy. Chair handy. Okay. your heart so you do what you can right start with your hand holding or for balance all the weights on that inside leg your outside leg is going to do the alphabet so capital letters I want you to make sure that you do test yourself every once in a while as you go through the alphabet Make it really fancy. Excellent. Make some big letters, some small letters. Breathe. Keep your heart lifted, your back flat. <laughs> if you lose your place, just jump back in anywhere. 
And if you beat me to the end of the library or end of the alphabet, just stop and I'll catch up. Uh, you. Going really fancy at the end. Fantastic. Set that leg down. Shake that out. Behind your chair. Perfect. You can hold your chair. Get your balance. Bring your feet just apart slightly. Toes out. Come up on your toes. Your chair for balance if you need that. Your toes. Slowly come down to your heels. And then into a squat. Okay. Make sure your knees are behind your toes. And then back up again. On your toes, back down into a squat, back up, excellent, down to a squat again, and you're working at your own pace, so if we do too many, you just stop and wait, and if you don't do enough, you can do more. Excellent. Up, slowly down. Squat one more time. Excellent, and back up. Fantastic. Other side of your chair. Again, you can start holding. Weight-bearing sides beside the chair. So we switch sides now. Outside leg, just gonna start with the alphabet. So, you work at your own pace. I'm gonna race through the alphabet here. Breathe, don't forget small letters, big letters, mix it up a little bit. Uh, try not to distract you. Dang, that's got to be record time for me. Shake your legs out. Excellent. Behind your chair again. So we're going to do some uh, quick ups, they call it. So we're going to do five of them. Just quickly come up and then slow down. So up and then slow down. And if you get to five before I do, uh, that's good. That's around five there. Excellent. Make your way to the other side of your chair again. So this is more of a static uh, balance thing. You're gonna bring, open up your hip, bring your heel to your ankle bone. Stay right here. You've got your chair for balance if you need it. Lift your heart, excellent. And this hip, you want to try and open it as much as you can. You're going to feel it in your hip joint. So just kind of moderate that. You want that to be, you want to try to find a new normal, an open, more open hip, but not so much that it gives you pain. Okay. Nice even breaths here from your belly, in through your nose, out through your mouth. Fantastic. If you're testing yourself, again, you've got more, you're more than welcome to lift that toe up. Check your balance a little bit more. Hand off the chair. Excellent. Perfect. Set that foot and toe down and bring that leg back in. Perfect. Other side of your chair. Do si do here. I'm going to do the same thing again. We're not going to do too much more in the balance, but bring that leg open, heel to your ankle bone, lift your heart. Fantastic. And if you have this, if you have no problem not holding on to anything, doing this, I encourage you to lift your toe up, get that ankle working more. You'll feel it. I guarantee that. And keep that leg open. Breathe. Excellent. Perfect. 
and then set your foot down, bring that knee back in, shake that out. Perfect. I'm going to get you to have a seat, have a sip of water too. Grab your bands. Perfect. So I'm going to come up. You can stand to do this too. You don't have to sit down if you don't want to. That's the good part. My guess is you're probably just about ready to sit down. Eh? Elbows up. Excellent. Bring your hands apart. Exhale. And then inhale back. Again. Exhale, open up. And inhale back. So keep your heart lifted, your back flat. We're probably going to do around 10 of these. So whatever your number might be. even breaths here. Exhale as you bring your fists apart. Fantastic. One more. Excellent. And just bring that down. Shake those out. Let's go for one across your knees. So it's going to go across the front of your knees. Hands are going to hang beside you. I just need to turn my chair here. Funny how I always turn to the left. Eh? Cross the bands across your feet, or across your legs rather. Heart lifted and your back is flat. Keep it straight. Okay. Hands hanging down. Exhale to bring your arms back and inhale back. All right. So exhale. And again, we're going to do 10 of these. So again, you work at your own pace. 10, 12, 8, 6, 4, whatever your number is, perfect for you. Perfect. Breathe. Nice work. Two more. Two. One. Fantastic. When you're doing these exercises, try and keep that everything nice and steady. Don't uh, bang your wrists, bang your arms around. Don't let them come back. Take control of them, you know. That's good. It's better. More muscles. Gives you more strength. It gives you more energy when you do that. It's all good stuff. Uh, Let's go with um, across the front. Oh, the back. So uh, we're going to do a from your back here. I don't know if uh, this is getting caught in the back of your hair. Just keep your arm out just a little bit farther away from your head. It's getting caught in your hair. I don't have that problem, but I've noticed apparently people have been having that problem. So just bring your arm out a little bit. Excellent. So adjust the band to what you need. You want to make it a little bit of a challenge, but not so much as you don't, you can't do it. All right. Excellent. Hard lifted, back flat, breathing in through your nose, out through your mouth. Excellent. Nice work. Two more. Excellent. Last one. Perfect. Just bring that down to your shoulder. Just let it sit on your shoulder for a minute. Let your shoulder and your back and everything reset. And when you are ready, bring that to the other side. Grab the tail. There somewhere. Perfect. And again, if it gets caught in your hair, just bring it off to one side a little bit. Adjust that band. Excellent. Breathe. Breathe. 
perfect. Five, four, three, two, two, and one. Fantastic, excellent. Bring that down, let that sit on your shoulder for a second. Bring your arms, let everything kind of reset. Because that's a good thing. I am going to give you, uh, just bring your knees and feet together. Take that band, you're just gonna wrap it around your knees and then underneath, and back up the other side. Hang on to those ears. Okay. Your knees are kind of locked together kind of locked. Back is flat. All right, heart's lifted. Just gonna bring your knees apart. Excellent. And slowly back together. All right. Apart. Keep your heart lifted. Back. Excellent. We do uh, four more. Excellent. And try and keep these movements fairly slow. Two. And last one. Perfect. Undo that band. We are going to do um, some seated, seated strength. So just set your band behind you. Okay. Uh, on your chair, just come up to the front of your chair if you're not already there. Take a breath. And again, when you're ready, lift your heart, your back is flat. Bring your arms up, it's gonna lock on here. And exhale, come back. That's actually going to be an inhale. And I'm going to exhale forward. That will make it easier. Inhale back. Just touch your, body, your back against the back of the chair. Exhale forward. This is a seated crunch. It's abdominal exercise. Inhale back. Exhale forward. So you're keeping your back flat. You're hinging from your hips. So just like a hinge on a door. Inhale back. Perfect. Try and keep your elbows up like they're on rails. Excellent. Exhale forward, inhale back, two more. Exhale forward, inhale back, last one. Exhale forward, inhale back. Just come off, touch the back and come off a little bit. Hold it right there for four, three, two, one, then all the way up. Perfect. Move your arms. Shake that out. Again, have a sip of water. We're almost done here. Um, cheek walk. So from the front of your chair, you're just going to walk your way to the back. Excellent. And then walk your way to the front. And then to the back. I have a short chair, so if you're not doing the same number, that's perfect. You just do what you do with your chair. Back to the front again. And then we're going to go back to the back. And we're going to stay there this time. Excellent. Put your back right against the back of the chair. Feet flat on the floor. Again, lift your heart. Your back is flat. We're going to do some sit to stands. 
when you're ready. Come up, make sure your knees are behind your toes. Inhale as you come up and then back down all the way down in your chair and all the way back. Kind of get comfortable. And when you're ready, again. Up again. And back. Try and come down nice and easy on your chair. Gentle, like a feather. Back up again. Inhale. Excellent. And back down. Perfect. Again. I think we'll do uh, four more here. And if that's not your number, that's okay. You do your number, all right? And up. Back down. There's three. Two. As you go down this time, make sure your knees are behind your toes. And last one. And have a seat. Perfect. Fantastic. So you're at the back of your chair. You take a big step to your left. Oh, your just take a big step. And you're gonna bring your other arm, other arm, other leg to meet. Okay. Keep your heart lifted and your back flat. <laughs> Breathe all the way through this. Leg back to center again. And the other leg. Excellent. We're going to the other side. Big step, big step. And then back to center again. Big steps. Fantastic. Let's go one more time, just because we can. Back. Add that second leg. Back to center again. Now we have to go the other way. We have to even it all out. Sorry about that. Back to the other side. And then back to center. And I promise we won't do any more of these today. Perfect. Fantastic. Um, let's do some stretches. Sound good? So again, just bring yourself up. Let's start with uh, behind your chair. So just stand up nice and close to your chair. One of your legs, just set them back. Wherever your back is, you wanna be able to plant that heel. So if you're set your foot back and that's where you can go, you just do that, all right? Everybody has their own kind of body, right? Front knee over the ankle. And use your hands, now you can use your thigh as a support or you can use the chair as a support. Your call. Try and get a straight line from that heel to this crown. Breathe. All of these are three deep breaths in through your nose and out through your mouth. Fantastic. That back straight leg, you're gonna bend the knee. Find where it bends for you, perfect. And if you kind of feel what has just shifted, you feel that muscle in the front is now shifted, or your calf muscle has now moved. Let me see, the sensation of that stretching calf muscle is now moved to the front. <laughs> Cueing for, for these kind of exercises is always kind of a challenge for me. Anyways. Excellent. That back leg and straighten it and just take a step forward. Perfect. And just wiggle that out. And then the other leg. Just set it back, plant that heel. And it's again the same thing again. Right? Front knee over the ankle, back leg straight, straight line from your heel to the crown of your head. Balance or balance, whatever you need. Three breaths. In through your nose, out through your mouth. So uh, my back leg, I'm flexing it. So my thigh is tightened up and it's giving a really good stretch on my calf muscle 
and the uh, hamstrings here too. Perfect. Again, that straight leg and a bend it. Excellent. And again, three breaths. Just enjoy the stretch. Find where it works for you. Excellent. I'm going to straighten that back leg, take a step. Fantastic. Pick a side of the chair. Inside leg. I'm going to bring it back and around to the outside of the other leg. Okay. If you've ever done yoga before or heard of yoga, this is called uh, the precursor for eagle pose. Okay. Twisted legs. This is to kind of get you into the mood of what's to come. Nice easy breaths. Your front leg, just release that tension on there a little bit. Just kind of bend your knee. Be gentle, you're gonna feel it in that hip. Excellent. All right, that back leg, you pull to the outside, you're gonna bring it back in, back in, and beside your chair. Fantastic. We're just going to go to the other side, do si do And again, the same thing. Inside leg, swap it out, bring it out to the outside. Find where that works for you. Get your balance, get your heart. And three breaths, in through your nose, out through your mouth. Nice. Again, your back leg, you're gonna grab the chair and bring that leg out beside you again. Just shake that out. So either behind your chair, I gotta go beside my chair because you won't be able to see me otherwise. So behind your chair, you're gonna give yourself a big wide stance. You can go into superhero pose if you want. If you wanna feel like a superhero. Nice deep breath in. Fantastic. Bring your arms back down again. Let's go with um, arms out to the side. Just watch what's around you. Thumbs up. Spread your fingers. Excellent. Roll your thumbs forward so they point down. Excellent. Breathe. Excellent. Roll those thumbs back up again. Nice and easy. Keep breathing, you got this. From here, you're gonna bring your arms back. So touch your shoulder blades together. Excellent, breathe. Again, if it doesn't feel right for you, don't do it, all right? Bring your arms back in line with your body. Perfect, lower your arms down, so 45 degrees. And you're gonna bring your arms back again, okay? Bring them back, nice stretch here again. Don't force anything. You want to stretch, you don't want to strain anything. Okay. Breathe. Excellent. Bring your arms back in line with your body again. Just lower them down. Give them a bit of a break. No, sorry, a bit of a rest. From here, lift your heart. Back is flat. Get you to drop your chin to your chest. Kind of enjoy that stretch in the upper part of your back and your lower neck. Nice deep breaths. Fantastic. Bring your head back up to center. And you're gonna lift your chin up this time. And again, stretch on your neck. A couple of breaths here. Excellent. Bring your head back to center again. 
Instead of looking to your left, I'm going to get you to drop your ear to your shoulder. Breathe. Nice and easy here. You don't need deep breath. Fantastic. Bring your head back up again. And the same for the other side. Breathe. Excellent. Bring your head back to center again. Interlock your fingers in front. Okay. Keep them low. You want to keep like an oval, an oval shape. Here. Bring those up. So your back is still straight and flat, but now you've extended your shoulder blade. You're moving them out around, right? Big tree hug. Or like you're giving a gr like a big hug to five people at the same time. Excellent. Breathe. Excellent. Perfect. Relax your arms and your fingers. Fantastic. Last one. Come down into a gentle squat. Nice deep breath in. Arms up. In through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. Take your time. No rush. Inhale up. Exhale down. Fantastic. Last one. Inhale up. And exhale just your arms. Fantastic. Fantastic. Nice work. Keep up the good work too, by the way.